Manuela. I was just wondering, what was it like back when you were involved with that opera troupe? Your life must have been quite different from how it is here, I imagine. My, how bold to ask an adult about their private life. I'll humor you, though. A diva's life is only glamorous while she's on stage. The rest of her time is consumed by grueling training. Just days and days of practicing, beginning at sunrise, with barely a moment to rest from one performance to the next. Then, once the performances begin, you're on stage for three shows a day. Absolutely exhausting. Is that anything like you imagined? It sounds like a world all its own. Thank you. I find the topic fascinating. What sort of roles did you tend to be cast in? As the lead performer, did you play the part of a princess much? Oh, I can only imagine how illustrious that would be. Yes, I was a princess once or twice. And it was quite something, let me tell you. All those royal jewels and flowing gowns. And they didn't just give me the pretty clothes to wear because I was beautiful, you know. I had to fight and claw my way into every role. But once I was there on stage, singing my solo, and all eyes were on me, it was worth it. I was rewarded for every one of my countless hours of practice. And the cheers when I finished a song, the applause, Oh, I can't properly explain it, but I can tell you, it's an experience I will cherish until the day I die. Wondrous! It all sounds so very glamorous. Despite how rigorous a schedule you kept, it sounds like the hard work was worth those fleeting moments on stage. Mine has always been a quiet life. It is hard not to feel a twinge of envy, hearing such stories from you. There's a lot to be said for the quiet life. It was never for me, of course. Still, I hear it's a pretty good deal for a lot of other folks. The thing is, Flame, well, you always have to remind yourself that if a place shines brighter than anywhere else, its shadows will be darker, too. What... what do you mean? Nothing. Nothing. It's a thing I hope you never come to understand. You know what? The next time you visit, I'll tell you all about the time I played a beautiful princess. And about the handsome prince she fell in love with. Oh, please! I would love to hear all about it!